No more phoning home. After 15 years of exploring craters and sampling soil, Opportunity has finally succumbed to the Martian dust. The mission of the golf cart-sized probe was intended to last just three months, but somehow it went way beyond the call of duty and delivered some truly groundbreaking revelations. The really interesting thing that they actually discovered was that there was water uh, where Opportunity had, had, had driven, which you could have drunk. Um, this is, you know, billions wow. of years ago, but um, you would have been able to drink that water. So it makes, it really kind of changes our perception of what we think about habitability on, on our neighbouring planet and makes us really have this, you know, wonderful set of images as well. I really recommend everybody go and have a look at the legacy of Opportunity. Opportunity landed on Mars in January. January 2004, one of a series of missions aimed at unravelling the mysteries of the Red Planet. It may have gone, but the exploration continues. There will be further launches in the coming years, with an eventual human mission still a realistic target. Neil O'Reilly, Euronews. Hey, what's up guys? Jake the Asshole here, with some very sad news. Apparently NASA just lost one of its rovers due to a giant sandstorm on Mars. In fact, uh, it looks like the Mars Opportunity rover has been lost forever and is now officially dead. It's very, very troubling news. When I, when I heard that the Mars Opportunity rover will no longer be sending back any data or any photos, I, I was pretty torn up inside. Um, the official story says that, um, that it was caught up in a sandstorm and that, that it got so dark that the rover was not able to recharge its batteries because the sandstorm just took up too much of the light. And so the rover, which depended on solar energy, was not able to recharge its batteries and Unfortunately, it is entered into an eternal sleep mode. However, just before Opportunity fell into endless sleep, it sent one last image from Mars back to Earth. The image taken by its panoramic camera was supposed to show a region known as Perseverance Valley, but instead, the image just shows static and darkness as the deadly sandstorm rolled through. So let's go ahead and take a look at that image now. But I must warn you, this image is very, very heartbreaking. The final image from Mars Opportunity Rover. And there it is, the end of the voyage of Mars Opportunity Rover. I can hardly look at this final image without having to hold back tears. So dramatic to see the black, staticky final image from the Mars Opportunity rover. May it forever rest in peace. And now I will dedicate the rest of this video to the Mars rover. And this is my own personal thank you to the Mars Opportunity rover and all you've done for mankind. Thank you. Thank you so much, NASA. I will remember you. Will you remember me? Mars Rover Opportunity. Just kidding! This video was most definitely sarcasm, and I think I laid it on pretty thick. There are no rovers on Mars, and there never has been. That shit is for retards. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Peace!